A relaxing visit to the chiropractor turns into a nightmare after police say a homeless man sexually assaulted a woman waiting to receive therapy. The suspect tried to escape, but the chiropractor and another patient chased him down. That man is behind bars tonight. KTLA's Rick Chambers is live in Long Beach where he spoke to the chiropractor. Rick. Yeah, sure. This practice here has been here for well over a decade, sees more than 100 patients every day. And they've watched over the years as the homeless problem has gotten progressively worse. But never did they expect anything like what happened this past Monday morning. The man in the white cap approaching the reception desk here at Clements Chiropractic in Long Beach is about to attack a female patient. He was standing at the front desk, fidgeting around, wiping his nose, and he has he to go to the restroom. As the man wanders down the clinic hallway, he enters an area where a woman's being treated. The patient was laying face down right here, and this is where he first spotted her. He, and she feels his hands go on her shoulder. Now he starts massaging her. And she says, is that you, Dr. Clements? And he doesn't respond. How he responds is he jumps on top of her and pins her down right after he pulls his pants down. As she stated, she could feel his genitals rubbing against her backside. He reached in and started to put his mouth near her ear. So then she quickly turned and looked and saw who that she doesn't know who that is. And that's when she started screaming that horrible scream that I was in the next room from here and my hair stood up. Cameras capture staff members reacting to that woman's scream and run to her aid. I asked the, the patient, why, what happened? What's wrong? She goes, the man tried to rape me. So a doctor and a male patient chased after the suspect. We're weaving through oncoming traffic, and I'm like, we got to follow him. So we chased him down. We finally both reached him. The patient grabbed his left arm first, and then I grabbed his right arm, and we spun him around, and I stopped the traffic, and then we, we, we hauled him back into the office. It was back at the office that the man suddenly got violent. He said, I don't want to go back to prison. I believe him being put into a small room, the door closed. He ripped off uh, a bar off the, off the wall and, and has a weapon now. So three employees held the man down until police arrived and then arrested the 57-year-old transient Ernesto Sanson. But local prosecutors only charged him with a misdemeanor and gave him a year in jail. He'll likely be out much sooner. And Dr. Clements is angry with how the city handled it. Now I have to be worried about having people coming into my business and raping my patients. As a community, we kind of come together and we need to, to, to point some fingers here at who's really not doing their job. And we understand that Dr. Clements is paying for the emotional therapy sessions for his patient, as well as beefing up security here at the practice in Long Beach. I'm Rick Chambers. Guys, I'll throw it back to you in Hollywood. Rick, thank you.